got the grandmaster teacher this here, the and deal. he's going to break that down for us. <laughs> this is the deal. We're, every one of them should have a Septuaginta. Septuaginta is the first Bibles. Okay. So if you or I are going to be a scholar and talk about we're going to debate this book, we should, should certainly know its foundation, shouldn't we? Mm -hmm. And then know that that came from the Book of the Dead. Mm -hmm. Debate about the books mm -hmm. that are translated out oh, of the original tongues, out of the original culture, without its Kabbalistic background, without most of them knowing anything about the Septuaginta, nor the 72 scholars who were signed by the Pope of Rome to transliterate this stuff. Septuaginta, nor the 72 scholars who were signed by the Pope of Rome to transliterate this stuff. Not only that, Going, I can edit that. Grace and peace, everybody. That's Brother Orm Bay. You heard Sinetta call him the master teacher. He's one of the leaders in the conscious community as far as the Moore Science Temple. And what he was talking about was the Septuagint. It was a Greek version of the um of the Hebrew Old Testament. Now, the one that he was actually talking about was a Latin version that came around later on that was translated from the Greek into the Latin. But the Septuagint was translated in 250, around 250 BCE. And if you look at the writings of Philo and you look at the writings of Josephus, Philo of Alexandria, and if you look at the writings of Josephus, they'll explain to you that it was translated for Ptolemy II, for the great library in Alexandria, there was a letter that was sent to the high priest in Jerusalem and he asked for scribes to come down with copies of the Hebrew Bible. There already was a Hebrew Bible when you deal with Ezra and what we call um, the second um, temple period with Hebrew and with Ezra and Nehemiah and other people. So he's wrong in the sense that the Pope got 72 people to translate it. According to Philo of Alexandria, there were six people from each of the 12 tribes of Israel. So if you Google it, you'll look that scholars would call it the LXX, the 70, because it was roughly about 70 or 72 scholars that translated it in Alexandria, Egypt in 250 BCE. Now, that's a major blunder when he started talking about the Catholics demanded that it could be translated and it was the first Bible. Historically speaking, that's not so. This was 250 years before the Messiah. So what he was saying, what he's saying is actually wrong.